Colorado is a, is a leader in the green energy space. And what's happening at the Evraz steel mill in Pueblo is a shining example, the first in the world to be largely powered by solar. This sets up the steel mill for long-term success. David Lawler is the chairman and president of BP America, a 50-50 joint venture with LightSource BP, which recently completed this 300 megawatt solar facility, 750,000 solar panels covering 2,000 acres of land. It's, you know, it's really designed and, and installed to to um, feed directly the steel mill. Kevin Smith, the CEO of the Americas for Light Source BP, says this project serves as an example of things to come. Worldwide, that heavy industry can, can depend on renewable energy to power their facilities. But what about jobs? What about the argument that green energy is killing the coal industry? Smith says, bottom line, a transition is happening. We're looking at solar becoming more like 30% of the of the mix, the energy mix by 2030, that would be close to a million jobs in the solar energy industry. So it'd be, it's, a, it's actually a huge job creator. And as for the 1,000 employees at the Evraz steel mill, Smith says their jobs are safe too, but this project wasn't cheap. A $285 million private investment coming into Colorado to fund and build new energy infrastructure for the state. Once it's in place, then you have this stable, low-cost source of electricity to go forward. So the investment, we need to make the investment, but it's well worth it in the long run. A big sea change is happening here, but Lawler says it could not have happened without Excel and Evraz, proving it takes a village to adapt. What we need at this point is we need good public policy, and we have some exceptional leaders in government here in the state of Colorado. And a world of opportunity awaits. It's not just steel mills, it'll be auto manufacturing facilities, it'll be mines, chemical plants, you know, really across the, across the board. I'm Eric Lundford, Denver 7.